Hey parents, this is Miss Simmons. I'm just going to do a quick tutorial about how to use Class Dojo um, as a parent. So first of all, when you log into your parent account, you'll see um, the class stories. If you have multiple children who are using Class Dojo, um, you'll see all the stories from from each of your children. So I have a second grader and a kindergartner, and I can see all the class stories um, that have been shared. But if I want my child to um, check their things, I'm going to click right over in the top uh, left-hand corner, and I'm going to select um, the student that I want to look at. So I just tapped on Brantley's name, and you can see his little um, emoji thing came up. And here is where um, your child is able to log in themselves. So this is where they would be able to do their work. Um, here, they are able to see their class stories. This is only things that have been posted for their class. Um, and back up at the top, you can see it says Miss Chadwick's class, and then it says four activities. If I click on Miss Chadwick's class, it's going to open up his to-do list. So these are all the things that he needs to do. Um, and then down at the bottom, it will have like his portfolio, and these are all of the things that he's completed that's been approved by his teacher. So we could go on there and look back at his work and make comments on it and things. Um, so if he wants to do one of his um, activities, he'll just click on it and then um, have a parent read the directions and then press start and work on it, you know, whatever it may be, typing or drawing a picture or taking a picture of some work that he's already done and then he will submit it and his teacher will have to um, approve it. So that is a little bit about how you use Class Dojo for assignments as a parent or for a student. Um, if you have any other questions, please feel free to reach out. Have a good day.